going to show how to create the drawing for the nut here on the fixture assembly. So going to Inventor, I have the model of the nut open. Going to File, New. I can create a new standard drawing.idw. Clicking Base, it should select the nut. Notice it already gave a pretty large scale of 18 to 1. And I can hit OK. And I'm just going to center it here. And I'm going to hit Projected to give a projected view here. And then I can right click and go Create. From there, I can go to Annotate and give some of the key dimensions. Going from here to here, I can dimension that. You notice that it is very small, the dimension. So I'm going to go to Manage Styles Editor wait for the window to pop up, and then um, go to text under once the window pops up, and just change the label and the note to 0.36. I think I did 36, so I'll go 0.36, and then 0.36 here. Save and close. And that makes the dimension a little bit larger there. Once I have that, I'm going to go back to the original drawing to see what they have. So they gave the size, the distance from the flats um, is 0.35, and the thickness is 0.20, and then they have this chamfer as well. And so going here, I can go back to annotate, go to dimension to give the height. 0.20. I can um, add in just this center point here. Hopefully, I can get it to show up. Doesn't seem to be wanting to show up here under the center point. Oh, right there. Just had to get to the center there. I can go to hole and thread and click here, and it should give me the full size. And then finally, um, the chamfer. So go to chamfer. Um, it's a little tricky here. I'm going to click this edge here and then the top and then move out. And it tells me that I have a 0.03 or 30 thousandths chamfer at 45 degrees. And that's en enough information there. I think it matches up pretty closely to what they were given.